Hi, I'm Andres. Uh, I play in Agony and Dia de los Muertos. I'm here to show you the Vertigo Elite, uh, one of my favorite Fernandez guitars. This one is equipped with the uh, Fernandez sustainer. Uh, it has an EMG 81 uh, in the bridge. Um, it has a solid mahogany body and a uh, set mahogany neck. It has a uh, beautiful abalone inlays, <clears throat> 22 fret um, ebony fingerboard. It has the um, licensed uh, uh, locking tremolo. It has th a three way selector switch. It has uh, volume and tone controls. And for the sustainer, it has an on off switch and a mode selector switch. Uh, if you're not familiar with the sustainer, uh, what it does is it holds uh, whatever notes are ringing on the guitar uh, for as long as you let them ring. Um, so I'll show you basically how it works. Uh, you turn it on from here, and then you just play any note. And it will hold it. So you can play any note or chords even uh, without um, worrying of them dying out. You know. And then the harmonic mode uh, brings out the fifth harmonic, so it's kind of like a feedback effect uh, without having to turn the amp volume up. Like right here, we're pretty low, and it's going to work just perfect. Cool, so you can do a lot of things, uh, a lot of creative things with the sustainer. Just, uh, I find it to be a great tool for uh, um, making the, the, the music a little more interesting, the, the, the parts, the solos, even rhythm parts. Um, you can also use it uh, on clean parts. It doesn't have to be always like a distorted uh, part. So you can do stuff like this with chords. And uh, yeah, you can add effects and combine them. And with the sustainer, you can just have endless possibilities. Um, it's great for soloing. You can switch modes while you play, standard and harmonic there. This is a song from Dia de los Muertos called uh, Sacrificio. <laughs> 